Hey guys, Eagle here, back with Project Duo SP. Today, as I said last episode, I'm going to be making my an automated chicken farm. Now I have the uh, tutorial, my other monitor, because I'm an idiot. But I'm just gonna do it as so I I know how to do it. It's just small things that I don't know how to do. So it's first it's a I think it's a three by five by six. Three by six by five. Okay. So I'm gonna do it as stone brick because I like stone brick. So I'm going to have it have it impressed one. So like that. So one, two, three. one, two, three, four, five. Is it six long? I think. I don't know. So it doesn't, doesn't even need to be shown. I don't think. One, two, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Three wide, one, two, three. Just put that right there. I think that's how it's gonna be. And the whole thing is by three, so that should be fine. I'll have it impressed like that. And it's five tall? I'm sorry, I'm an idiot. It should be five tall, okay, so we got uh, one, two, three, four. I probably just left there. Whatever. Um, okay. Okay. Referencing the video, what you need is blocks. One chest. Let me actually put all my stuff away that I don't need right now. Uh, that's needed. I don't need. I'll take the pick. I'll take the sword. Shovel. Don't need. Food. I'll keep. Don't need the water buckets. Actually, we'll need water buckets, I think. No, I won't. We'll need lava bucket. Okay, I'll get the lava here later. Blocks to have, okay. One chest. I don't think it needs to be trap chest. No, it doesn't need to be trap chest. I'll just make, I'll just make one, because I don't know if I... Uh, okay, I don't know if I have it. I don't know if I have a pre-made chest. I'll just make another one. Spooky sound effects. Chest. Full hoppers. Thankfully, I went on an iron grind. So, do I have any open, ch any made chests there? I actually do. Oh, good, 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 good. So, the four hopper. One, two, three, four. Full hoppers. As a dispenser, which is made using MI Smart. I need a bow. Probably needs to be a fixed bow and redstone. I'm pretty sure. Is it like that? I think it needs to be a fixed bow. A fresh bow, I should say. Do I have a scrap bow somewhere that I can just repair with it? I might. Maybe I don't. Maybe I just make another bow. Okay, I don't feel like repairing anything. Just because I didn't feel like wasting. I was in the hopper there. I need. I don't feel like wasting levels. So string over in a side space. He has string. Do really don't have any string, really? Are you kidding me? Kind of a Minecrafter, am I? There's string, string, sticks. Just enough sticks. Because this, remember, this has to be a dispenser, not a dropper. A dispenser. Yeah, I'm smart. Okay, dispenser. Uh, one redstone comparator, which I'm gonna. Because I'm an idiot. Uh, Why doesn't Luigi just come up when I type in Minecraft? Like me, if you have any issues, that's the wrong wiki. Let's see. Comparator. Okay, smooth stone and, uh, what's it fucking called? Uh, 
quartz. Quartz. Smooth stone and quartz. Think we'll have smooth stone over in a site's uh stone smelter. Let's see it's three, so one, two, three. And redstone torches. I know how many redstone torches. I do actually have some somewhere, but I don't remember where. So I'm gonna assume I don't have any. And three of them, I think. Three, whatever. I'll just make eight. All right, comparator. This time, make a comparator, everyone. So keep watch. Comparator. Okay, and you need, let me just switch back, six redstone, so redstone, let's see, so we got blocks, uh, chest, one chest only, dispensers, comparator, redstone dust, dispenser, dropper dispenser, um, Glass, 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 glass. I bet a side has some glass. Here's glass. I need one more glass. Let's grab these stuff to put them away. Okay. That smelt should be done. All right, four glass, three carpetas. I'm gonna go with fancy Mahinta. I'm gonna go with six. You need three, I'll just go with six just because I'm probably gonna lose some um, carpet in the dispenser or in the dropper. I don't feel like fishing it back out. And what else did I need? Bucket of lava and two um, repeaters. Repeaters are made. You know, I used to be a pretty decent redstone redstone guy. I don't remember. That's easy. I need more more of aside smooth stone. Sorry, buddy. Three, I believe. Three. Two torches and a piece of redstone. So I have everything I need. So I had everything I need, I just didn't remember how to do it. Let's see, stone. Is it, yeah, it's like that. There we go. Repeater, I need one more, actually, so I don't know why. <sighs> ADD, I guess. Also, I just remembered. I'm probably not going to be continuing, uh, what's it called? Uh, atmosphere horror map, because it's no longer horror season, and also, I couldn't figure that thing out for the life of me. It was like, no, why? I don't, I, I didn't mean to understand. And I need, what was it else that I needed? I need one bucket of lava. So I'm going to go get the bucket of lava, and I'll be right back. Okay, I am back. I got my bucket of lava. So I think we are ready to do this. So first step, let me just reference my, my tutorial. See, so it looks like you need a chest. Like so. I'm gonna break these blocks both so I can have some movement, so I can move around a bit. Just like so. The popper pointing inward towards it, and blocks surrounding it. All right, that's the first layer. Kind of. This looks actually stupid, but it'll make sense when I'm done. The next major key point, although I'm obviously looking at the thing, but the spencer, right there, half slab on top of there, and glass on top of there. Alright, next, all right, the most important part, I believe, redstone. <clears throat> So we're going to do a repeater facing inward, another one facing outward, 
Imperator, inverted, with redstone going all around. That should be good. All right, next layer is the hoppers. So one hopper facing into the dispenser and the other two facing like that with the carpet on top of that. I know that much. And the blocks like so. You can have it like that too. I think that should work. I don't know if that's how it's supposed to work, but um, I'm going to be stuck here. So I'm going to actually break these because the tutorial doesn't say to do this yet. I may not need to. I think, actually, I know you do need to, but I'll do it later. Let's see, blocks on either side. Let's see, you can still see this crappy one right here. Let's see. The lava right there. Shit, no, not that way. Forgot the other, forgot the other glass. Glass, then lava. Right? Yes. Okay, you, you, okay, now you do fill in the rest of this. As so. I'm just going to use all the stone bricks. Because, you know, why not? I clear so let's have some walking space. I got lit on fire. I'm sad. It hurt me. The <laughs> lava hurt me. Mommy, help. Right, I'm building blocks around like this. Top here, so I have more walking space. Pressure to clear it like a 10 by 10 or 20 by 20 space where I did this. You can see it's already working with the drops I accidentally threw in here. I don't know if it's burning or not. It shouldn't be, but I don't know. So like that, and I believe, let's see, what is the next steps? So the sixth and final layer is the most common. Alright, lastly, all you need to do is fill in block crown. This guy recommends, which means I recommend, um, having it so, glass there, having it where, I think a block goes up here, yeah, block goes up there, where it's, it's surrounding in a three-dimensional fashion, so there's no chance of the chickens to glitch out, because... Apparently there's a way, um, if the chunks unload and they reload, the chickens may not be in the same exact position, so they'll, they'll spawn inside of a block. And they'll suffocate or they might just escape, so to minimize that, put blocks all around the entirety in three-dimensional fashion. I call that good. Um, I'm just stuck here now. No, I'm not. Okay. And just put blocks like that and throw your chickens in. There's a way to make it so you can turn it on and off, but I'm not going to do that because I'm just have it running at all times. If I need to turn it on and off, I'll just kill the chickens on the inside. Alright, um. I'm going to go grab me an inventory full of eggs, I guess. I'll show you guys how to make it both automatic as well as. Um, whatever. Yeah. What was I grabbing? Eggs. Yes, eggs. Some eggs. Put this excess stuff back. I'm gonna go grab some eggs. I'll just go grab, um, should they all down here? Right there. Yeah. That should be enough. You can just throw eggs right in the hoppers and it'll automatically start doing it. It won't, they won't be automatic, but it will, it'll start the process. I, I need to fix all this. 
because it looks really ugly. Come on, baby chicken. Come on. You piece of shit. There's one. There's two. Three. Four. Let me just drop the rest of these in. Okay. The way this will work is the chickens will not burn up when there is when they're babies. But when they become adults, they will start burning up. Which will um it will kill them, obviously. And like 98% of the time the drops will fall into a uh, will fall into the hopper. There is rare cases where they will just burn up, but it's very rare, very unlikely. So where did I put my stone? There they are. So unlikely it'll happen, which is very good. Just cap this all off. There we go. Hopefully it works. I'm sure it will work. Um. So yeah, automatic chicken farm. I'm gonna come back in about a couple hours, see if it worked. I'm sure it did, but you know, maybe not. I don't know if those chickens leaving grow will be adults by then. So I'm gonna I'll, I'm gonna come back in a couple hours, see what happens. So I'll see you in the future. Hey guys, I am back, ready to check out my uh, chicken farm that works. Um. I'm in limbo of recordings, waiting for other things to happen, but here we go. Not bad. Not bad at all. There's four adult chickens in the top, I believe. There should be at least here soon. I'm going to fill them up here at some point in time and get that working fine. So with that, I want to thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Remember, if you did, leave a like and subscribe for more content. I have multiple recordings after this that I'm working on exactly at this moment. So, I'm tired. I want to get content out for you guys. So, remember, leave a like and all that good stuff. And I'll see you all later. Yeah.